You don't build a house without its foundation. You don't build a hospital without its nurses. Um, so I have now been a nurse for Franciscan Health East Lafayette Emergency Department for almost six years now. Luckily enough, I was able to get in here at Franciscan Health in the ER, and I've been here for three years now, and I, I enjoy it. So every day is different. Um, every hour is different. Um, every, every minute, minute is different. different. Um, you literally walk into work not knowing what to expect, and you stay that way for your entire shift and, and every shift thereafter. Um, but the Nursing Excellence Fund is, um, it should help with retention, you know, in in the ER, which is a very big thing. Like like Tara was saying, you know, we we walk in and we know exactly who is doing what. Um, so a lot of times there isn't a lot of communication going on, but there is when there needs to be. I can remember when um, the patient was in the trauma room, huh, and mom was at bedside, and this kid is younger, has a whole life ahead of him. And mom is standing there crying and she says, he's going to die. You have to save him. You have to save him. And I just walked over to her and I just put my arm around her and I said, we're doing everything that we can. Everything that we can. He's in great hands. And it, for me, it wasn't so much talking to mom, but just being there. Just being there, putting my arm around her, holding her hand, getting her Kleenex, just knowing I am here to take care of the patient but I'm also here to take care of you. Mm -hmm. And to me, I just want to treat every patient and every family member the way that I or my family would want to be treated. So yes, it is taking the vital signs and doing your patient assessments and you know, absolutely focusing on the patient. But at the end of the day, it's also just as important to have that emotional connection with the family too. Right. I am here for you. Yes, I'm doing my job. Yes, I'm taking care of the patient but you're my priority as well. And it speaks volumes. And like I said today, we're still in touch. And I love them and they love me and we talk pretty frequently. And it, it's hard not to take stuff home because these are real people. These are real people's lives. These are real families. And if you can put yourself in that position, how would you feel? How would you react? And it, it, can, it can break you down or Absolutely. it can build you up. The Nursing Excellence Fund is so important because I think it will genuinely help us to take better care of whatever patient and their family members when they come in. I think you should donate to the Nursing Excellence Fund because we need your help. In order to take care of you, we need help in return because this is going to help us so much get the education that we need um, and, and really take care of patients better than what we did yesterday. Absolutely. I'm Amanda. And I'm Tara. And, and we, we are Franciscan.